Hey, what is up, Productivity Junkies? Darren Persinger here. I want to show you the newest tool, a plugin for WordPress blog sites that I am just losing my mind over. Um, it's called Scribe. It's right here. You can go check it out. ScribeSEO.com. It's from Brian Clark, a.k.a. Copy Blogger. If you're into building your business online, I'm sure you've read his website, copyblogger.com. Follow him on Twitter. He's uh, at copyblogger. A genius when it comes to SEO stuff. And I've been checking this out all week. And then on Wednesday, I went down to Portland and ran into this, this brilliant guy when it comes to analytics, search, um, anything to do with that. And his name is Gaylord DeWald. He writes for Inman, has a great website called um, thoughtfaucet.com. And Gaylord started talking about this. And so he and I were talking a lot about it. And, and I was showing it around to some people down there, making it happen on my blog post, how it actually operated. And so Gaylord validated what my opinions were of this. And so I want to share this with you guys. I need to share this with you guys. And I'll show, I'll show you what we were doing down in Portland with it. Um, here's how Scribe works. Scribe sits in the upper right hand corner as uh, the plugin and I write my blog, I add in my title, my description and my keywords and I'm going to update this so that I'm ready to rock with this and here's all I do. I hit analyze and it's going to tell me how SEO friendly that this blog post is. So I don't need to know any tricks of the trade or study any of this stuff. I just need to know what it's telling me. And ouch. Um, this says that my SEO score is 21% and that I need to fix it. Now the great thing is right here, it tells me exactly how to fix it. I have too many characters in my title. I have no primary keywords and there's no primary keywords in my body. My description has no primary keywords. My body has too few of words and the keyword productivity exceeds maximum density. All right, so let's go to town on this. Let's fix this up. Now, one of the things I'm going to do immediately is to see how to fix this. I'm going to go to change keywords and it's going to give me some suggestions on exactly how to do that. So adding primary keywords to make productivity, real estate and lead generation primary keywords. Add them to your beginning of your title and description. Perfect. All right. So I can go do that. So change keywords. I'm going to head down here. Lead generation. I want to be, have them be one of them. So they said add that to the front. So lead generation three hour day is outdated. All right, now I'm going to do the same thing here in the description. So delete, copy, paste, the lead generation for three hours a day is becoming outdated. Content creation is key to long-term success. productivity in real estate. All right, so I switched that up. Um, it also said, remember, uh, oh, no, you know what? I'm going to take productivity out of there. It said productivity was too big. I was using it too many times. So content creation is key to long-term success in real estate sales. All right, so I'm stoked with that. 
Um, I'll quickly review, see what else it was saying. No primary keywords, but that could change now that I did that. So I'm going to reanalyze again. Do, do, do. I always get so excited just anticipating what's it going to say. Boom! Look at that. 73%. I went from 21 to, to uh, 73% with those few small changes. Now, the one thing, though, it says the keyword productivity exceeds maximum density. It's still too many times I'm using the word productivity, and I know why. So let's go fix that. What I do at the bottom of every blog post is I add some other posts to that to go check out related posts. One of the things I'm going to do really quickly here, instead of posts, I'm going to do related real estate coaching videos. All right, I'm going to get rid of posts. And you see, I'm using productivity all the time down there, and that's the problem. So get rid of these things. Hope you guys are having fun watching me see, be completely transparent about uh, what I do with my blog here. All right. So now let's try this again. Analyze. Bam. All right. 87%. That's about the best that I can do for myself um, because I am a video blogger. So adding an additional 300 words uh, to me is overkill. So 150 is about the max I'll roll with. I, I'll even push 200, but I'm, I'm putting out too much if I'm doing uh, written blogs and video at the same time. So just, I want to do a keyword analysis really quickly here. Lead generation, outdated. I want to make, I want to try to get real estate to be a keyword also, a primary keyword. So I'm going to go to change keywords and see if it gives me a tip on how I could do that. To make, at, see, adding primary keywords. To make outdated real estate day and blog primary keywords, add them to the beginning of your title and description, reanalyze to see the keyword review. All right, so real estate. Um, I already have lead generation, but I want to make real estate a keyword too. So lead generation three hour day is outdated. Real estate lead generation for three hours a day is becoming outdated. Did I have real estate in the title there? Lead generation, three hour day in real estate is outdated. All right, let me see what that did. I'm going to analyze this now. Hopefully, I didn't screw anything up and I only enhanced it better by adding some primary keywords. What I'm looking for is over here, these primary keywords. And there it is. Did you see that? Um, don't need to mess with this. Although I'll show you really quickly some other cool things. The SERP, what it will look like on Google. So lead generation three hour day in real estate is outdated and it adds that really quickly while I'm here. I don't want to have to come back and do this. This is stuff that it says, uh, the following list semantically uh, relevant terms that have been identified within your content. Consider adding these terms to your posts tags. So I am going to do that. Copy. And then I'm going to get out of here. Uh, add the tags. Boom. Add. All right. But as you see here, my primary keywords are lead generation and real estate. You guys, you know what business I am in. I'm in the business of helping real estate agents with their lead generation and their business development. This is a great blog post for me. Thanks to ScribeSEO.com. Head over there quickly and 
and sign up because this just came out this week. They're running a ridiculous offer, $27 per month for 300 evaluations on a number of different uh, websites. All right? So I'm using this on another website too, but this is a great deal. If you're doing AdWords right now or something like that, I would change that to, to using this tool for a while and see what you can do with that so you can get organic search to work for you. And if you're spending money in a magazine or, or in print still, stop that and immediately do this because this is going to be so worth the investment. I wanted to show this to you guys. If you have questions, send me an email. I'd be happy to talk to you more about how this is working for me and how it would work for you. DarrenPersinger at gmail.com. We'll talk to you guys soon.